Good afternoon from Vung Tao, Mum, Dad and the Kitties. We've got a treat for you today. We're going to take you around and show you what there is for families here in Vung Tao. Yep, and first up is what's there? Well, it is Na Sao Fi, which is Selfie House. And it's a fun little place where you can take what else but selfies everywhere. Yep, so let's have a look. Here we are. So it's just a short taxi ride from where we were staying. Yeah. Hello, Sinjo. You want to visit? Visit. Visit. Yes. <laughs> yes. We want to visit the selfie house. I believe it. No, we don't have a ticket. <laughs> we need your help. <laughs> we need your help. Uh, two, two. One, two. Okay. Thank you. 80,000. 80, for two. So for two people, that's a very good price. It's a very good <laughs> price. <laughs> Come on. Thank you. All right. Let's go. Upstairs. per person is under two dollars so even if you've got a large family it's a good price to come here <laughs> it is oh yeah what do we have stick your head in there nice take a selfie Steph are you gonna volunteer oh, oh this is good can you stand on something back there? Um, there's, I'm, I'm kneeling because there is something that will make me too tall. So this is really for the kids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a nice one, a Barbie one. Ooh, a Barbie. How timely, the movie just came out, didn't it? The movie that was banned here. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. The Barbie movie is banned in <laughs> Vietnam, guys. Guys, did you enjoy it? Yeah, it was pretty fun. It was fun? <laughs> yeah. yeah. And are you from Phuong Tao? No, we're from Germany. I mean, we were born there. Oh, okay. Wow, awesome. And how are you liking Vietnam? Yeah, we're visiting families. Yeah? yeah, so you're having a good time? Yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. So when you come into a room like this, And then you can also pretend to put your foot on the chair and get a great shot like that. So there's a lot of kitty actions you can do. Get really cool photos. We'll drop our photos in right here so you can see what I mean. And they give you some example photos on the outside so you know what to do and also there are staff here who can help you. So here we have some of the example photos and here's a young man helping us. Thank you. <laughs> I'm waiting for him to come back so Susan can cut me in half. I mean, gosh, what I do for this channel. <sighs> so definitely bring your kids here. <laughs> definitely, it's so much fun. <laughs> so, room, room, got my chainsaw. Room, 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 room. <laughs> for under two dollars, it is definitely worth bringing the kids here. And we're not kids, but we had a great time. So this is similar to what they have here, which is the upside down house. And we'll show you that as well. But yeah, for 40,000 per person, come on, bring the kids. If you're feeling thirsty at the end because it's hot and hard work, yeah, you can get a drink downstairs. There's a guy that goes around, he helps you take all the shots. And it's a great, great little like hour out. Perfect. And upside down house was cheap too. So it's worth it as well. Yeah. So we'll drop some clips in from our experience at Upside Down House the last time we were last here. Last time. 
and uh, definitely yeah. come to one of these if you've got kids or if you're a family, even if you're not a family, come to one of these. Yeah, yeah, if you're a couple, <laughs> it's great. Yeah. And uh, yeah, spoil the kids and take them to both. Exactly. <laughs> Wow, what a fantastic little place. That was awesome. And if that was a little bit too participatory for mom and dad, we've got somewhere else for you. Let's go. We're waiting on a grab, hey? Yep. And how much is a grab going to take? Uh, 35 to get from here to the next cafe we're going to. And it was 42000 from our hotel to here. So it's all very cheap because the distances aren't very far here in Vung Tau. That's right. So there, that, those taxi rates are just over a dollar each. We've made it yes. to Art cafe Mio. Art Mio. So this is supposed to be a beautiful cafe. We're going to show you around and I need something to drink after that hot and hard work in the selfie cafe. Xin chào. Xin chào. What's on the menu, Steph? Of course, they've got Drinks. splendid coffee. Oh, okay. That and sounds good. They've got fruit and detox tea, hot chocolate, uh, mojitos, and soda. I might get a lemon mint leaf soda. Okay. And yeah, more drinks, more cakes. Yeah, looks good. There's juice. So, what are you going to have? Um, I might get a. I'll get the lemon mint leaf soda. Okay, and that's 39, so that's what, about a dollar fifty, dollar yep. sixty. Um, I might have the salted caramel coffee ice blended, yes. please. Yep, and mine's 55, so that's a bit over two dollars. Yeah, and I mean, the reason we chose this cafe, besides it being beautiful, is that for families, if you've got little ones, there is a nice little play area, so mom and dad can have some peace. Yeah, so you can bring your little kids in here, little toddlers. Uh, I don't know, five and under, is it? Maybe? Yeah, probably. Five and under, and they can play lots of things to touch and spin. So, you can have a nice ice drink or a nice juice, and the kids can play to the heart's content. Yeah, so it's a nice little pit stop as you make your way around Vung Tau on that long weekend from. Ho Chi Minh. And it looks like they must have live music because everything's set up for it. Indeed. Oh, and look here. Oh, wow. Saxophones. Saxophones. Yeah, that you might know, but Steph used to be able to play a saxophone. Yeah, I used to play the baritone sax, which is the biggest one, which is almost as big as me. I used to sit it on the floor. That so looks like sat. this one. Yep, that's this one. And I also played tenor. So, um, yeah, that was a long time ago. I wouldn't want to do it. I probably would so sound like a dying goose. So how old were you when you did that? From the time I was in sixth grade, so about 12, until I was about 20, 22, I wow. played the saxophone. so you were quite good. Yeah, I was quite good. I was in all the bands, jazz band, marching band, uh, choir, like, what do you call it? The, the regular choral band, all of that. Um, but I haven't touched one since I left uni. <coughs> yeah, wow. And they've also got some outdoor seating here. If you want to sit outside and Hong Tao's heat. We've got a demista as well. Righto guys, so I ordered myself a salted caramel coffee and it looks divine. And Steph? I have soda with uh, lemon and mint which is very refreshing so that's why I got that. Yep and like as always in Vietnam you get what? Free like jasmine tea or something. This one is some kind of herbal some, tea. Some, some sort of herbal tea, iced tea, just for free. Nice while you wait, especially yeah. we were thirsty. And to wash it down, but look at this. Yeah, that's gonna be so good. Mom and Dad, this is definitely a good place to come. And the drinks are a lot more reasonable than in Saigon. So like the cost of it for a mm. cafe like this is really reasonable, isn't it? Yeah, and with a place for the kids and lots of I don't know interesting things to look at. Good place to come. Yeah, so yours was thirty nine thousand yeah. dollars and mine was fifty five. So you'd definitely be looking at about eighty or ninety in yeah, Saigon. And for probably mine. fifty or sixty for mine. So Yeah, in this kind of cafe. Yeah. yeah. In, this is an art deco cafe, guys. It is really special. It's totally quiet now unfortunately, but I'm sure it gets happening. I'm sure it does, so. Yeah. And that little kitty spot 
Um, it's a great place to leave your toddler and have a break yeah. while you enjoy a cool drink before you head on out for another um, indulgence in an <laughs> upside down house or a selfie house. <laughs> yeah, selfie house. Um, and yeah, this is a lot more relaxing now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, that was a delicious drink and a nice chance to cool down and get out of Vung Tao's heat. Um, we're heading out, got to go pay first though. And Steph, next step. We're off to an Aussie cafe here in Vung Tao. Now, I didn't know one existed, but that's where we're going for lunch and I can't wait. Green and gold, we're almost there. <laughs> Matilda's. It's just a stone's throw from Prompt Beach. It is, you can see the beach is just down the end of the road. And here we have the bar, um, I don't know, bistro here. It's a bit quiet. Here at Matilda's they have an all day breakfast, an American breakfast, an Aussie breakfast, the country breakfast, omelettes, eggs benedict, um, pancakes. If you're not sure what your kid might like there are several kinds of burgers including an Aussie burger with beetroot which is really hard to find in this part of the world. Um, also we have sandwiches, we have tacos. So um, if your kid's a picky eater, um, you might be able to find something here for them. And of course there's pizza, so children are always keen for pizza. And of course you can have a beer, and I believe they've got the NRL on, and they probably have other big matches on when they're due. Exactly, so you know, just you can come if you want a bit of Aussie, Aussiana, is that what you call it? Australiana. <laughs> Australi Australiana. Uh, you can come, you can get your burgers and all that. If your kid isn't a picky eater, there's heaps of places in Vung Tao to eat, but if they are picky and they're Western, this is a good place to come for burgers and pizza. Yeah, so we're going to share one, hey, because yeah. we're going to have to go for dinner a bit later. Yeah. And it's already kind of mid-afternoon. But we're definitely having the Aussie burger because yeah. I miss beetroot on a burger. Yeah, so we'll have the Aussie burger with some fries, hey? Yep, perfect. All right, let's uh, find the waiter. Yep. And here it is, guys. Our Aussie burger has arrived. I think there's some beetroot on it. There it is. There is. Oh yeah, yeah, there's a little slice right there. And we also have some coleslaw, some cheese. Some ham. Some ham, yep. And those fries look good, eh? Nice thick cut fries. Yeah. Awesome, let's dig in. So I definitely think this is it. And the burger's not too big, so it's definitely um, a meal size for kids actually, or for a teenager, this one. Yep. Um, and yeah, I suppose you could share it if you had younger kids. They'd certainly like these fries. Yep. So I think Matilda's is a good place to come for mum and dad, family dinner. Yep, definitely kid friendly place. Yep, so let's hook in. Yeah, I'm hungry. Alright guys, we finished up that burger. Um, quite nice. I wouldn't say it was a massively great burger, but it wasn't bad and the chips were delicious. So <coughs> definitely uh, a meal that teenagers or youngsters would like. And so if you've come to Vung Tao and this is your first day, this basically sums up what you can do in your first day. And if you're looking for things to do on your second day, please check our previous video up here, or I'm dyslexic, maybe it's up here, or maybe you just want to check the description. <laughs> <laughs> but we have lots of other ideas of what you can do as a family here in Vung Tao. That's right. And uh, of course you can also just go to the beach if you want a relaxing day. So I'm sure if you've got teenagers or or young kids you definitely want to spend at least a half day at the beach it's very hot here in Vung Tao though and very humid so you probably don't want to stay out in the sun too long all right so that is us for the day thanks for watching we're girls on the loose we are catch you next time bye bye, bye.